Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at some tech I picked up from a store called Five Below. First up is going to be an LED diffusing speaker where if the speaker is not wireless, it does however diffuse oil. So let's get right into the unboxing of it. Okay, now that we got it open, let's see what we got. Looks like I have the lavender and white colorway. I believe they had all white and silver, also white and black um, in these. Let's try to open it. Well, that's where the oil will go in at, right there. Um, moving right along. Let's see what else we got in the box. Looks like we have some instructions. Don't think we need those. Uh, 3.5 millimeter jacks at 3.5. Like I said, the speaker is not Bluetooth. Um, it does require you to plug in. What else is in here? Three millimeter tape, not sure why. You might find out, you might not, because I don't plan on reading instructions. We do have a little care card in here though. Um, it states that we need to allow at least 30 minutes for the oil to heat up. I'll let you guys see. Um, yeah, I'm probably not going to put any oil in it, but yeah, 30 minutes for the oil to heat up. Let's see if we can turn it on. Nothing. Maybe this one. Or not. Looks like I need batteries, three AAAs for the LEDs to work. Let me grab those and I'll be right back. But it wasn't a match Wrote some songs about Ricky Now I listen and laugh Even almost got married And for being I'm so thankful Wish I could say thank you to Malcolm Cause he was an angel One taught me love One taught me patience And one taught me pain Now I'm so amazed So sound quality test went well Again, this is a $5 speaker didn't sound too bad for the price as well as it plugs in it's still a 3.5 to 3.5 so I expect the sound quality to be a little bit better than a $5 Bluetooth speaker I'm pretty sure the oil will melt once the speaker heats up I'm not too worried about that I think that make a great stocking stuffer um, especially with the LEDs the three changing of the color and the sound quality so let's hop into the next tech find which is a wireless charger so this is a wireless charger. It works both with Android and iOS. Um, rotates 180 degrees. Tell us a um, LED indicator as well as two USB ports on it. So let's go ahead and unbox this guy. Okay, so it looks like we got some instructions. The wireless charger itself, a Y cable micro USB. We'll see what how this works in a second. So we're actually gonna plug this into my laptop. That way I don't have to find a five watt adapter to plug it into. Again, if the desk plug in too much work, we're just gonna plug it into the laptop. So let's get this open. So sounds like I'm gonna break it. Yeah, we should probably look at the instructions. Let's see what we got. All right, this is not really telling me too much. I only pay five dollars for it. If I break it, I break it. Whatever. Oh, 
that's the hinges it's supposed to sound like that okay so if you pick this up and it sounds like you're about to break it that's how it's supposed to sound let's get it plugged in and then we'll see if this guy actually works Okay, so we got it plugged in, it charges wirelessly, it lights up, the two USBs at the front work, it's a still $5. Let's move on to the next product. Up next we have this robot, um, it is controlled by an app, it's supposed to have like voice commands, um, do all these cool little things, so let's get it unboxed, test it out and see if it's worth the 5 bucks. Okay, now that we got that guy out the box, it honestly didn't come with too much because you scan the back of the box, that's what a QR code is, to get the app downloaded. The app does work on OS and Android, so it shouldn't be too hard to download. What is hard is getting this guy to go the right way by using the controllers that is in the interface of the app. So what I'm going to do is insert a clip of what the app looks like right about now. So basically once you have the app downloaded, um, you Bluetooth the two together and then the two circles are your joystick. So that's how you get him to move where you want him to go. There's also a voice command feature which we're going to test out. Actually let's go ahead and do that now. Go left. Go. How do I say it? Go left. Okay, so the voice command feature can use a little work, or I can use a little work, one of us can use a little work, um, but the joystick works just fine. There's also a feature where you can draw the direction you want him to go. So I just drew a little circle, that's why he's circling around. Um, I think it's a cool product for kids, and he fell off the desk. So moving right along. Okay guys, last but not least, we got a nightlight that has two USBs. Um, on it, one's a 1.5, one's a 2.4, so you can charge a tablet and a phone. Has a sensor on the front, so it senses when it gets dark and auto turns itself on. Simple product, not too much to talk about. Um, this video, this actually concludes this video of Tech Finds at Five Below. Don't forget to subscribe for your chance to win a hundred dollars, giving away for every 1,000 subscribers we get, and also thumbs up if you like this video. Catch you in the next one.